I really wanted him, you know, like five levels ago. That would have been sweeter. Not even five levels ago. Fucking seven levels ago. It would have been much nicer. Not a whole lot we can do. I mean, we could go to Targaryen, but I'm kind of like... It would just be to grind out shit. And that, like, optional 10 floors that it gives you... Apparently levels us up really fast, so... Might as well wait for that. What will you do? So that was cool. We made Odin. The Storm God. Although I think he's like the chief deity of the Norse pan like pantheon. What do they call him? The Allfather? I don't follow a Satru, so... It's chilly today. Eyad Gadol Leolam Adonai. Miss Onishi, oh, Onishi left early, so I'll be teaching today at her place. I think today we'll learn about near-death experiences. There's no real reason for it, they've just been on my mind. Now, a near-death experience is defined as something an individual experiences just before death. Is it true It is. Is it true insight into the afterlife, or simply a trick of the brain? Opinions vary, but it is true that near-death experiences have been a hotly debated topic for some time. There are a few surviving records of ancient near-death experiences. According to the writings of Plato, a resuscitated soldier experienced the afterlife as a spirit. A similar incident was reported in Japan by ethnologist Kunio Yana Yanagita in the Tono Monogatari. Psychologist Carl Jung wrote that in his own near-death experience, he saw a vision of the earth from afar. I'm sure you've heard of your own stories from famous or infamous individuals. I have a few first-hand reports with me today. Let me read some of them to you. I felt as if my soul was detached from my body. I met a friend who had already passed away. I saw my whole life flashing before my eyes. I saw the most brilliant light. I was bathed in light. I experienced complete and total happiness. This is called euphoria. These kinds of reports are typical. Some have attempted to make direct recordings of near-death experiences. Researcher Kenneth Ring has tried to quantify near-death experiences with the Weighted Core Experience Index. Modern efforts have led to a new theory of near-death experiences which goes like so. If an individual who's dying denies that fact, he eventually realizes that death is a reality that he must accept and becomes angry. As a result, he'll try to do anything he can to extend his life. But the futility of this leads to depression. In the end, he accepts his fate. Although we may initially deny death, we'll accept it in the end. That's just how we humans are. Is everyone listening? It's not like every day you hear a lesson like this. <laughs> how about a little test to prove you were listening? Get it wrong and memories of your life at school will disappear. At Atha Gabo Leolam Adnai. Who should I pick? Alright, Norio, I ask thee. What is the feeling of happiness in the near death experience called? Oh, it's euphoria. Yugoslavia? Some people say a near death experience awakens one's higher consciousness. Whether or not that's true, there's an observably lower fear of death in those who have been through one. Perhaps this is because near-death experiences are surprisingly free of pain and suffering. But that is not to say I didn't want any of you to seek one out. That's not to say I want any of you to seek one out. Use the time you have here wisely, okay? That's all for today. Class is dismissed. Why do they let, that, like, why do they let this guy teach here? He's just kind of a whack job. But you know, what he's saying is very fitting for our situation. Oh, hey, it's Mitsuru. What a coincidence. Well, since you're here, I'd like to ask if you're free after school. I don't know yet. I see. Well, I'd like for you to come with me somewhere. That is, if you're available, just let me know. Masuda wants you to go somewhere with her. Maybe you should talk with her after school. Maybe I should. Maybe I should. Class has ended for today. So we could test out that theory that uh, Yuko only knows if she sees us. 
But seeing as how Yuko was two-timed, I'd feel kind of horrible about that. I mean, I don't care about Chihiro because she can't do anything about it, but Yuko can still be reversed. You forged a bond that cannot be broken. I mean, you know, realistically, I'd like to have everybody at least five. At at least five, but... Can't date two girls at the same time unless it's maxed. Excuse me, sorry. Fortune is something I could work on. Today is Tuesday, after all. Je suis désolé. Oh, Norio-kun, I'm going to club right now. What are you going to do, Norio-kun? Because it would have it would have been nice to be able to make Norn. I don't know if we'll be able to make Norn, but we can certainly try. Let's do it. Oh, then let's go together. KSK seems happy. Norn would be the only other thing that I'd want to make, because I wanted to turn Norn into... Garuda. You hear a beautiful melody. KSK's trying to get your attention. Psst, Norio Kun, can I talk to you after music club? You participated in the club activity. Gekko Khan High School Rooftop. You can hear the, the pounding of feet as the track team runs its laps. Everyone's working so hard. So are you, what do you want? Is that what it seems like to you, Norio-kun? KSK seems a little sad. Was I? Well, I told my dad about my opportunity to study abroad, and get this. He said I should give it a try. Can you believe that? Before he was telling me I should quit the club. All he ever wanted was for me to become a doctor, and now he's saying I should follow my dreams. I don't know what I should do, I'm so confused. I mean... I mean, I would say study abroad, but it's like... This is what you wanted, dude. That's true, but if I study abroad, it'll seem like I'm only doing it because my dad told me to! Here we go with this. Thanks, I've been having a really hard time with this, but I feel a lot better now. You're the only person I can talk to, Nodio kun Your relationship is stronger now. It's like... Your dad's finally giving you his blessing, and now it's like, what? If it's what he wants, then I don't want it because I'm a fucking teenager. And it's like, ooh. Dude, if I was rich enough to study abroad, I would have done it. Like, come on now. And times were so much simpler fucking back in the early 20s, 2010s, the aughts. Not even the aughts, but like the 2010s when I would have been able to do it. I guess the late aughts is when I would have been able to study abroad. In either case. This dude's complaining about fucking first world problems. Let's get going. I'm having my driver pick me up, so if you want, I can have him drop you off near your dorm. Like, this fucking dude has a driver. I don't know about studying abroad. My dad wants me to do it, so now I don't want to do it. It's like, must be nice. Arf. Oh, wait, I'll take you for a walk later, dude. Hold on. Let me save first. Because we're going to have to get close to calling stream. Oh shit, is my sound? It should be. Yeah, my sound is on. It's only 106. I've yet to receive a phone call. So let us uh, continue then. For just a little while longer. <laughs> Koro-chan's as happy as ever, even though it's cold. Hey, Norio-kun. A shrine may be an odd place to bring something like this up, but do you have any plans for Christmas? Um, I'm assuming you're free, of course. I have some preparations to make. Oh, um, you spoke quietly with Fuka. I hadn't really thought about it. Welcome back, Koro-chan. Do you want a bath again? I'll clean you right up. Christmas, huh? You know, I hadn't thought about it. What will you do? 
Um, I forget what days the music club is. Apparently, we have today off. What's special about Wednesday? What the what's special about the twenty third? Today's the emperor's birthday. Oh, there's no school. Can't relate. Although we do get President's Day, so. Hello, it's been ten minutes, so I can comment now. Yeah, it's been I like triple that amount of time. But uh, yeah, thank you for your comment. Thought you were gonna go visit your mother's grave. Oh hi, Sonata-san. Is this where you should be? Well, I was planning to. But when I thought about what I was gonna say to her, it just didn't feel right. But yeah, thanks for the follow, dude. I, I really appreciate it. Yeah, same here. I don't have anything I need to tell Shinji right now. I have my own stuff to deal with. An undefeatable enemy, huh? Gosh, wonder what it's like. Doitashimashita. I think that's what you're trying to say. And uh you got me. Yes, thank you. But it doesn't matter because I've made up my mind. I'm gonna look it straight in the eyes. And punch it right inside of him. Straight in the eyes. You study Japanese, you are Japanese, or I like the sound of that. You can count me in too. I'm rusty myself. I haven't had anybody to speak with in a very long time. Hmm. Yeah, I'll say it's been a decently long time. It's been over like 10 years at this point. Emperor's birthday. I think Tuesday, Thursday, Friday is music club. So either I hang out with Maya today or we go pray at the shrine for the music club. Although I suppose at a first meeting of us too, I should have said Hajime Mashite. Yoroshiku onegaishimasu. It's been a while, it's been a while. Shrine. Duke of Game Toimas. Well, Mato. Motachi no name wa Mato des. Deskedo. I don't know what I'm trying to say after that. Like. Tashin. Watashi. Aota Kemi des. Yoroshiku Negashimas. Yoroshiku Negashimas. Social links, musician. I'm good, right? I mean, I can understand your sentence. Although, I don't know, it depends on if you're being. Well, are you actually Japanese? Because then, if I was like, oh, you should put this here, you know, I would, I would sound like a douche. Days until New Year's Eve. Well, I'm going to fight. Well, I thought about it, I realized there wasn't really much choice to be made. I don't want to have to tell my mom and Shinjiro san that we failed. Ao Takemi. That is a nice name, though. I'm not Japanese, but I want a Japanese girlfriend. Interesting, interesting. I had an acquaintance of mine who had a hat that said that. Unless you're secretly my acquaintance from my college days. In which case, that would be quite funny. Quite serendipitous. Hmm. 
Wednesday, Wednesday. This was back when I was an undergrad in college. So it would have been crazy. A crazy coincidence if it ended up being the same person. But that was a while back now. Bro, I think the screen bugged. I mean, well, it's paused right now. Like, if because if I if I click off of the game, it'll be um. Let me mute myself. So it's still showing Akihiko and K. You might have to refresh because on my preview it's it's um it's normal. So yeah, on my preview I'm seeing what I'm seeing on my screen. If that makes sense. So you might have to refresh. I saw this. It's an important day in Europe and America, although unlike in Japan, December 25th, Christmas Day is even more important. Do y'all know why we celebrate Christmas in the first place? In Japan, Christmas Eve is just a day for couples to spend time together and give gifts. Feel tired? Close your eyes for a few minutes. Stay awake. It's interesting that a day which is celebrated worldwide is observed differently from country to country. Another example is Valentine's Day. Try looking it up online if you're interested. You stayed up and listened to the lecture. Your academics has increased. They also like to eat fried chicken on Christmas for whatever reason. You received a text message. Sorry to ask at the last minute, message from Yuko, but it's Christmas and all. If you're not busy, can we get together after school? Well, I guess I have no choice. You promised to spend time with Yuko. Good thing Chihiro didn't care. Yeah, Valentine is for girls to confess to guys, and then White Day, which is a month afterwards in March, is um, when a guy gives his answer on whether or not he reciprocates her feelings. And it's usually you have to give double the amount of gifts. Usually. I've been around the block, I've been around the block. I've studied, like, I haven't studied all aspects of Japanese culture, but I did take Japanese when I was an undergrad, and I had a lot of Japanese exchange students who were friends, so... Those were good times. I hear the decorations and lights are beautiful. You decide to spend Christmas Eve with Yuko. I became a huge lover of the language. You know so much, bro. I've learned. What have you learned? Well, let me. First of all, let me close my preview again so that like the game doesn't constantly keep getting. Interrupted. Oops, I didn't mean to click that. You've come to Polonia Mall with Yuko. Wow, it looks so different. It's beautiful, so what's next? I know, I'm so excited. Yuko seems to be enjoying the Christmas decorations. Uh, we should stick close together since it's so cold out. Hey, look over there. You walk around and enjoy the lights with Yuko. That was so much fun. Wait a minute, hehe. <laughs> Do you want your Christmas present now? I'm your present. Just kidding. Merry Christmas. I mean, <laughs> nothing fancy, but it works. I mean, it's cute. It's cute. I learned how to make it a long time ago from my grandma. It's going to get colder, so take care of yourself. You have something that might make Yuko happy. Would you like to give it to her? Sure. Uh, do I have an antique? Which item will you give her? Google-eyed idol. 
flowers? I don't think I have any flowers. So... She didn't like the perfume. I don't know if she'll like the purse either. What about this watch? Wow, I didn't think you gave me something so nice. I don't know what to say. Thanks. Cool. Cool. Last time I gave her perfume and she didn't like it, so it's like, okay. Back to the drawing board. This isn't my usual Christmas, to be honest. I'm normally not that interested in Christmas. It's nice, sure, but it's just another day. But when I was a kid, we had chicken and cake as a family. After the presents in the morning, I'd wake up and find the presents right by my pillow. I really believed Santa had come during the night. Back then, it was so much fun, and now this year it's fun again in a different way. This is my kind of Christmas. Do you mind if I snuggle up to you? I bet you're cold too. What do you need is a big hug to warm you up. Come on, Nylight. I had stuff to do. We've shared a tender moment with Yuko. Very nice. Very cute. I'm glad we were able to experience it with somebody. Shoot! How to get so... Oh, I got a whiff of... Speaking of perfume. That's weird. Nobody's in the house but me. I swear to God, my house is haunted. I don't want to go home. I want to stay here. Just kidding. I mean, we have school tomorrow. We can't stay here all night dressed in our uniforms. So we gotta go home, right? Well, let's stay a little bit longer. You spend time with Yuko until night came. It's a very... I mean, these are little sweet moments. Like I said, like this game is different in the fact that it's like a lot like a dating sim. With some fighting thrown in. But that was cool that we got to do that. Pray, bro. Maybe ghost. Uh, I don't, I'm not afraid of ghosts, like I'm used to supernatural stuff. I mean, I could just be crazy, so that's also something that's very possible. But I don't get a, a fearful feeling from, uh, from supernatural stuff in the house. Merry Christmas, y'all. In uh, the U.S., people are out of uh, school by, by this time. But Japan has so many, like, national holidays, it's crazy. So today's Friday. Bebe. So I can't really do music club today. Yuka's right there. Social link. Like who was I? Well, I plan to max out fortune if I could. I don't know, I'm like torn between rival athlete and fortune. We're not going to be able to max out everything this playthrough. We'll do that next playthrough though, for sure. But I studied German, I studied Japanese, I can speak some Spanish because that's my heritage. I grew up hearing my grandparents speak Spanish. My mom speaks... I should say New Mexican Spanish. We're from the state of New Mexico in the United States, so... It's our own dialect of Spanish that we speak around here. Language is one of my passions. And I was fortunate, fortunate enough to meet all kinds of awesome people when I went to college, so. My German teacher was from Berlin, and she was super cool, and my Japanese teacher was from, um, I want to say she was from Kanegawa. Moma-sensei, she was super cool. I had a crush on her all those years ago. Um, I met tons of different exchange students. My university had a student exchange program with uh, Nagoya University of Foreign Study, so we got lots of students from Nagoya that came over here. Lots of fun times. They taught me the Sodan Bushi, the fisherman's dance. That was fun. It was nerve-wracking. I don't know if it's still on, but it's like somewhere on Facebook. There's a, a video of us dancing it. I had, overall, aside from the crippling debt, I had a good time in college, so I won't complain too much about it. Hmm, 
We're not going to max out fortune. It's just not going to happen. I have Japanese friends then. Yeah, I have... I mean, we haven't... I didn't stay in contact with them. I'm, I'm a very antisocial person. So... But, um, yeah, I have a couple that I still try to talk to every now and again. It's not hard to find Japanese people. At least to try to talk to them. Like, there's an app called Hello Talk that's really good. A lot of them like to use Hello Talk. Makoto Yuki IRL. Is that the name of the uh, the major from Ghost in the Shell? No, I had lots of like there was my motorcycle. I mean the MC. Sorry. What was I doing? I think I'm going to Naganaki Shrine. No, not the shrine. I need to go hang out with Mamoru. That dude's in um, Iwatodai. Iwatodai Strip Mall. Or Iwatodai Station. Yeah, if Makoto Yuki is any sort of like anime reference, I don't know anime. I don't know a lot of that stuff. I was. I'm really not into anime or manga. The only thing I do is play. I do play dating sims and I do play H games. Sorry, bro. I think I spoiled something. Makoto Yuki. I mean the MC. Sorry, main character Makoto Yuki. IRL. It's fine. I, I mean, I still don't know what you're talking about. So as long as you don't clarify it, and then it won't really be a spoiler. Excuse me, sir. He walked to die strip mall, Wakatsu. That's fine. Where have you been? Hey, did you know this day is December 25th? <laughs> Fate, death. What a terrible Christmas. Christmas will be better next year. That's right. Next year. We're not going to let the world end. But yeah, I think we're going to stop here because my voice is like shrek dudes. Like I've been talking for like four hours straight. But uh, thanks again for hanging out with me, Owl. Hopefully you find that Japanese girlfriend that you want. But, uh, you know, all the followers, I love you all. You guys are going to push me one more step to getting affiliate, so I appreciate that. But uh, if this was your first video, please consider liking, disliking, commenting, subscribing to me on YouTube, follow me here on Twitch. There's going to be a card up top with a playlist of this game. And so today's Friday, so I won't be back until Monday. But I usually start streaming around 9 a.m. GMT minus 7. Like, I, I only know, like, U.S. Uh, time zones, so sorry about that. But, like, I know that we're 7 hours behind GMT here in my state. So if you want to come hang out again, please feel free. And then we'll see you guys Monday. Have a good weekend.